gonna be nice and safe for everybody. Oh. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> What's up, with River Floaters? We came down here to Ann Morrison Park to talk about opening days coming July 1st. And I figured this was a good spot to start because what better place to begin than the end? This is where you're going to be pulling your boat out when you get to the bottom. And if you rented equipment, you're just going to want to drag it up and haul it across the field over here where there's going to be some people attending, waiting for you to haul your boat up. And all they're going to do is just load it up into a truck and take it back to the Barber Park. Of course, this year they're going to be sanitizing everything pretty well. Get ready for the next round of floaters. But I wanted to take you over here and show you that if you wanted to be parking down here at Ann Morrison Park and taking the shuttle bus, what to do, where to go, and you'll get a whole line. We'll have buses will come in and park right here, and there'll be the equipment pickup it lines up right here and there'll be even a vendor down there sometimes if you're not familiar with Ann Morrison Park you'll find the line to wait for the shuttle bus just next to the playgrounds on the edge of the parking lot and the entrance of the park and we'll have this bulletin here with more information on when everything starts it's it has a couple of other things in it right now so if you're standing here waiting for the shuttle bus to show up, make sure you got $3 per person to get on the bus. And there's a flyer with all the dates and times of the availability and the prices for that too. So you might be wondering what you're going to find when you get up to Barbara Park. So after about a 15 minute bus ride on one of these guys, you're gonna end up here at Barbara Park, and if you need to, you can grab your stuff out of the back or haul it with you. Sometimes you carry your tube or your raft or your oars or pumps or whatever you need. Just carry it with you. At the at Ann Morrison Park, you just throw it in the back. Then you want to get off the bus. You come right over here, and this is where you're gonna rent your raft. Once you get it, you can just take it right across the field and put it in the river. There's a cool place to put your boat in, but if you need to air up, well, obviously there's no pumps. <laughs> Not this year, make sure you bring your own. I bring mine, I take it with me on my boat just in case I start losing a little bit of air. Maybe I meet somebody that needs some air. If you have a pump, it's valuable to have, don't leave it in your car, take it with you. If you have to park your car, expect to pay $7 per car this year. And taking the shuttle, it's going to cost you $3 per person. You know, if you just like to support local businesses, make sure you like and share and subscribe to this channel. I'll be on the river all summer long if you want to see more of the river. If you enjoy these videos, and I really hope you do, I hope you share them with other people. I want to get the word out and I want to be able to share this information with as many people as I can. It's really important to me and I hope it becomes something that's really important to you too.